All right, well, we are wanting to talk about our digital citizenship day that we're going to do for the students, uh, staff, and parents on January 4th. And so I thought I'd invite Karen Dooks here, our technology integrationist, to kind of give an overview of what we're doing for uh, the kids. January 4th, our administrative team and tech team have decided to have a day called Hashtag Jeff Pride Day. And this day is going to be a day to celebrate the positive aspects of social media and yet teach students some of the negative things that can happen with social media. And we have brought in several speakers and several technology opportunities for students. So I'm gonna tell you a little bit about our schedule for that day. First of all, that when the students come, they're going to be in mixed grade levels in a homeroom and they are going to have a Nearpod lesson, which is a real interactive um, technology tool where the students will be learning about digital citizenship. Then we have Dr. Mark Adler and his wife Joni coming to speak to the students for about an hour, and their story is going to be a little bit sadder. Um, they lost a son to suicide from a sexting um, and bullying um, thing that happened and Mr. Grizzle will talk about that. Um, then the students are going to talk with um, our school lawyer and I'm going to let Mr. Grizzle talk about that for a little bit and then I'll tell you more about our day. A couple of things that we have for our parents that I really want to encourage our parents to attend. Uh, like she mentioned earlier, Mark and Joni Adler will be coming. Uh, Mark is the superintendent of Ralston Public Schools. Uh, a couple of years ago, they lost their son to suicide, and they've kind of taken, taken the mantle of uh, promoting positive digital citizenship, and I would encourage parents to look online to what uh, the Adler story is. Uh, hashtag Be Kind is uh, their slogan, and that's going to be really impactful for parents and it's going to be impactful for the kids as well because they really talk about first-hand experience with the perils of uh, cyberbullying and, and sexting and those kinds of things so that's going to be important so that's at nine o'clock on that thursday so we're encouraging all parents to come to that um, that can then the next thing with the parents is uh, over the lunch hour we're going to provide lunch for our parents we're going to have a sack lunch um, for them to enjoy while they are talking to Bobby Truy. Now most of our parents have seen Bobby speak to us in the past. He's come and talked about digital citizenship. This is not going to be a specific presentation for the parents. This is going to be an opportunity for the parents to ask questions about uh, digital uh, media, about the pitfalls and legal pitfalls of social media and those kinds of things. So I know we've had some issues in the past uh, dealing with uh, social media problems. This is going to be a great time to ask Bobby some legal questions about that. Um, we do ask for the lunchtime that they RSVP uh, to the high school office uh, as er by no later than January 2nd, so we have an idea of how many lunches we need to prepare. But I would really strongly encourage everybody to take their lunch hour and come up here to the high school on, on January 4th to uh, talk with uh, Bobby Truitt. Okay, and I will have more information on our school website about that um, opportunity for Lunch and Learn with Bobby Truey and our parents. So watch our school website and then it will have an RSVP number included. Um, Bobby is also going to be speaking with the fifth and sixth grade at Jefferson during that day. And then those students will also have an opportunity to visit what we call a tech playground and our high school students will have that opportunity also. In the gym, we're going to be setting up stations around the gym and the students will be able to fly a drone, do some coding, play with some robotics. And so it should be a great day for the students to get their hands on technology. And um, we also have an opportunity with the UNL Extension Service, with J.C. Milius and with Darcy Plachek from our um, Jefferson County Extension Service. They are going to create a maker space in the Media Center for kids to explore and get their hands on some tech tools and things like that. And then to close our day out, we um, Fairbury Public Schools has the opportunity to welcome Kevin Honeycutt who is an international um, keynote speaker, and he is coming to our school to talk about 
social media, um, digital citizenship, but mainly leaving a positive digital footprint in the world and um, using technology tools to promote yourself in positive ways. And so we are really excited about this opportunity, a whole day of, of learning about digital citizenship, but also getting your hands on some tech tools and using technology in a really positive way. So it's going to be a combination of things. It's not going to be just lectures. It's going to be opportunities for the kids to explore and, and really try some new things. But we really want to hit the parents hard at 9 o'clock and noon.